Now more of Making the Turn on the PGA Tour Network. Our next guest follows the maxim that the idea in life is to get in as many rounds as you can before you go. His name is Peter Terabainen. He has been playing professional golf for probably longer than he can remember. He's played all over the world. He um, is domiciled in Singapore. And this is a guy who, wherever there's a purse, you can find him on the first tee. Morning, Peter. Hello, Peter. Nice to, nice to talk to you. Nice to, isn't it fair to say the, the idea of your life is to get in as many rounds as you can before you go? Certainly in the 80s. I, was, uh, I played the world tour before there was such a thing, playing in uh, Africa, Europe, Asia, Australia. Uh, wherever there was a tournament, I was there. Why is the Todd Hamilton beating Ernie? Why is the Y. E. Yang beating Tiger not a shock to you? Well, I I was uh, able to watch these guys up close uh, in Japan. Uh, Todd in uh, 2002, 2003. I actually used to travel with him and uh, played all my practice rounds with him. I had a bad back, so I wasn't able to practice. But I would uh, after I had my uh, after our practice round, I'd have a Japanese bath, and then I'd go up to the driving range, and uh, Todd would still be there, and he'd he'd be practicing uh, all afternoon. So I enjoy I always enjoyed uh, watching him, and I actually was able to make a little money on the practice rounds because he was so good. But I don't know. He had a, he had a little bit of a funny swing, and uh, I always said I had played 15 years in Europe, so I knew, and I had played in about seven British Opens. And just something in my mind, I just said, I think Todd could do well if he ever got into a British Open. And I think I actually told him that a few times. And uh, so he played great in 2003, uh, won, uh, won four tournaments in Japan. So he went to the U.S. Tour School. And then uh, in March, he won the Honda. And uh, so then uh, that year at Troon, uh, he did it. And... For me, I, I wasn't surprised. Uh, one of the sports writers from uh, Sports Illustri- Illustrated gave me a call before the round on the Sunday, and he says, well, how do you think he's going to do? I said, I think he's going to win. I think, I think Todd will win it. He's, he played very well in Japan, especially on the uh, windy sea- seaside-type courses in Japan. I said, I, I think he'll win it. And uh, I wasn't surprised. I was <laughs> and extremely happy. So after Todd went to... Uh, like I said, I went to the U.S. I didn't have a practice round partner anymore, um, and my back was so bad it was it was difficult for me. But I and I played a few practice rounds with the Y.E. Yang in uh, in 2004 and five. And uh, I must admit, I didn't predict that he would uh, be a major winner. But I saw how hard he worked, also, and uh, I think that's something people in the U.S. they they see these players who just come and they think, oh, he's come from nowhere. Oh, there's no way he can win. Well, they, they didn't see them, how hard they've been practicing the last who knows how many years. And uh, I, was, I was at a ringside seat watching how, uh, how those guys practice in Japan. All right, let's get back to this Japanese bath thing. Is that the thing that Sean Connery, 007, had in uh, You Only Live Twice? Uh, I, I can't remember what it was in the movie, but at every it golf was, course in it Japan. It was good. <laughs> Every golf course in Japan has a bath. Uh, it's it's an ex- it's an experience to play golf. For some of the businessmen, it it can be an all day experience. Uh, the golf and the eating and the drinking and the bath afterwards. Certainly, for somebody who had a bad back, that uh, that was very relaxing after my uh, practice rounds and tournament rounds in Japan. What are you doing uh, as you head back to Singapore? What's next? Well, I've been I've been playing professional professionally for 30 years, uh, but uh, I had back surgery last year, so I think it's uh, maybe it. No more, no more golf. So, so when I get back to Singapore, I'm going to try to do some work with uh, JD Group, uh, filling uh, different entertainers for golf events in Singapore and throughout Asia. On the product side, uh, JD Group has uh, Go Low Golf Dice, which has been a big success for the company. They have applications on Facebook, so people can uh, play golf against each other anywhere in the world. There's also an application on iPhone. Shake your iPhone, and you're shaking the Go Low Golf Dice. 
I can even try to make birdies and eagles now, and I won't hurt my back anymore, which is nice. And so uh, if, if you'd like to uh, see more of what we're doing, you can visit www.jdgroup.us, and uh, you can see what uh, the company's doing, and hopefully I can help them out uh, to expand into Asia, in Singapore. I uh, appreciate the time today. I'm sorry that we don't have a longer time to chat. I hope you'll uh, come back on shortly. There's so much I'd like to talk to you about. Uh, Nicholas, some of the experiences that you've had on tour, we barely scratched the surface, and uh, thanks for scratching it with me. Oh, great. I'd, I'd like, love to come on any time. My great pleasure. That's Peter Teravainen, very long-time tour player. Um, he, he's kind of a cult figure, uh, really, in, in golf circles. He uh, struggled for so many years to make a living uh, from tournament golf, Literally played um, all over the world, has been living in Singapore for a, a long time. Uh, funny, we got uh, an email just a couple of minutes ago talking about uh, Liberty National and the fact that a lot of the guys are trashing it. But this guy said, hey, everybody has to play the same golf course. And guys like Sergio and Goidos and Leonard and Allenby, who are really good ball strikers, are going to find their names at the top of the list. And uh, as far as Tiger's concerned, he's saying that the course is too tight for him, the green's too small, um, so that may be one of the reasons Tiger's not too thrilled with the golf course. There are places he doesn't like to play, just like the rest of the guys. Wishing you all a happy and a healthy weekend. Hope you hit lots of greens. Hope you have lots of birdie chances. Hope you have lots of fun. Have a great day. Golf talk is only Peter can deliver. Making the turn with Peter Kessler. Brought to you by the Jim McLean Golf School. World class golf instruction at Premier Destination.